All right, y'all, what's up? This is Bobby Bass at a barbecue and metal. What's going on? I don't have my uh, nice barbecue backyard that I used to have. This fucking light is too bright. God damn, I'm an ugly son of a bitch. Hold on, man. Let me turn this goddamn thing on. All right, that's better. It gives me a little bit more of a mysterious, smoky look to me. All right, so I got I got my, my ribs cooking on my smoker. My, my smoker. Wait, where the fuck is it? It's right there. It's my goddamn stove. I'm cooking it on my stove. And the reason I'm cooking on my stove is because the fucking communists that run the, the, the fucking apartment complex I live in won't let me have a smoker. Actually, that's not true. I can have a smoker. But it's got to be an electric smoker. And, alright, I'm half... I, I, I don't know. I, I, you, know, you know what, to be honest with you, electric smokers are really good. But, they, you know, you, you get the same results. I just can't walk around swinging my dick being like, hey, I'm going to smoke this goddamn ribs and I came out and I kept the temperature at 225 for three and a half, four fucking hours. I can't be doing that with this. So, I don't have it yet. So, what I'm making today is uh, candied, candied ribs. They're candied ribs in the oven. And I put my rub on it. It's actually the first time I'm making this. I made candied ribs before, but to be honest with you, they're great. I know they're going to taste good. I'm getting half shot in the ass. And by the way, I'm not listening to metal today. I'm listening to blues. I'm listening to a little Steve Ray Vaughan. I probably shouldn't even be saying that because I'm going to make 300 yanked off the fucking thing. I'm not listening to Steve Ray Vaughan. I'm listening to um, Johnny Lee Vaughnstein. He's a, a Jewish blues guy. He's fucking awesome. He sounds just like SRV, I swear to God. Anyway, so we're making this. And the only reason I didn't show you the prep of it is because if it fucks up, I can deny I ever did it. See? All right. I will be back, I'll show you the finished product, and the next week when I make it again, or two weeks from now when I make it again, I'll, I'll let you know, I'll, I'll, show you, I'll show you the video of how to do it, okay? It's not, not that hard to do. It's in the fucking oven. It's not that hard to do. I mean, you know, come on, man. I mean, what the fuck? Is, you know? Look, TV dinners or ribs. Go out to dinner or ribs. You want to eat at fucking McDonald's for two people? It's going to cost you 20 bucks. The way I eat, it's going to cost you $20. For this, you can make some fucking ribs at home with some, some rice and some collard greens and some, well, you got your own beer instead of having to, you know, having to deal with uh, E-A-G-L-E-S. Anyway, that is what I'm doing tonight. My wife's been gone for a week and, man, I fucked this apartment up. She has no idea. When she comes home, I'm going to get my ass kicked, son. I'm going to get... Three, three way, look, if you don't hear from me anymore, it's because I'm dead. And she buried me in the fucking yard. Actually, I don't have a yard. It's in the dumpster. I'll be in the dumpster, and nobody will know because nobody gives a shit. They smell something, they'll think it's like a dead rat. So, anyway, I'll be back, and I'll let you, I'll let you see how it And I, I swear to God, I'll let you know how it tastes. And if it tastes like asshole, I'll let you know. Wait, turn this fucking thing off. So, here's the finished product. It looks delicious. I haven't tasted it yet, but I can tell you right now, even if it tastes like shit, it, it would be worth going through all the, the hassle just to have a piece of friggin' ribs that looks like this. It's, it looks fantastic, and I'm sure it tastes great, too, because I cheated a little bit, and I tasted it before I put the before I put the glaze on it, and then I know what the glaze tastes like, so it, it, if it tastes like shit, it's because God hates me. Anyway, no, that's not the reason. Uh, it's going to taste good. Uh, I want to cut into it. I'm going to take a taste. I'm going to show you the inside, the finished product, and then in the next week or so, when I make another, uh, when I make this again, I'll I'll show you the uh, the step by step instructions. And by the way, you have to be really careful when you're when you're reducing that soy sauce because I'll tell you what, man, it boiled over onto the stove, and I was hating life for like 20 minutes cleaning that shit up. So just be really careful. All right. Hey, what's up, y'all? Alright, the ribs are done. And I gave them a taste, and they are. Mm, they're nice. Real nice. All right, I'm going to give you a little show here. I'm going to show you what they look like. Wait, I don't think I can. I don't think I can turn the damn thing around. I can't even fucking talk. Look. I'm going to turn around. I'm going to show you what they look like. Hold on. Alright, see that right there? That's what my ribs look like. And they are fall apart tender, man. Look, I want to, I want to, hold on. I can't, look at this, they, 
it, it, there's no meat on the damn bone. I cook bones. It's fantastic. Dude, I'm not even kidding you. I'm a big fan of smoking ribs because I can't do it right now. I have to find another way to barbecue. And I've been cooking this shit for four hours. So, barbecue is low and slow. Now, I didn't have a grill and I didn't have smoke or anything like that, but I improvised. And I'm telling you, you can barbecue inside if you need to. Like, if, if you don't need to, then just do it outside. Don't be a fag. Just, just do it outside. You'll be fine. But, at the end of the day, you want to have some nice sweet meat. I like sweet meat. Who doesn't like sweet meat? I mean, it's like salty and sweet. You like that. So we got that, and then we got some uh, we got some collard greens cooking over here. I ain't going to show you. You know what the hell collard greens look like. What, I got to fucking walk your hand through everything? I got collard greens cooking over here. I got a little bit of ribs. We're trying to we're trying to cut down the carbs a little bit. I know I got like four cups of friggin' sugar on these goddamn ribs, but you know what I'm trying to say. I'm trying to do the protein and the collard greens. It'll be nice. It'll be real nice. Anyway, I'm going to put together next week a nice video, or maybe the next couple weeks, a nice video showing you how I did everything. And um, if you like it, watch it. Well, you well, you got to watch first if you decide if you don't like it. But if you don't like it, I don't, I don't give a shit if you don't like it. It's delicious. Trust me. Anyway, this is Bobby Bastard signing off. And uh, check out my uh, my YouTube channel, Barbecue and Metal. I got like no followers right now because I'm a fucking scrub. But at some point, this video will be worth something because it'll be when I had no followers. And then when I got like 20 million followers, everybody would be like, damn, this is when Bob had no fucking followers. Anyway, peace.